Hotel industry representatives on the state and national level say a second round of federal assistance is needed to help the industry recover from the impact of COVID-19's pandemic. News for Jack's reporter Jennifer Reddy calls, tells us where the CEO of Visit Jacksonville says we stand locally. As cities across the country reopen amid the coronavirus pandemic, many industries are still recovering. Roughly 65% of hotels remained at or below 50% capacity six months into the pandemic, and 40% of hotel employees were still not working. That's according to a recent report from the American Hotel and Lodging Association. Our industry continues to work to try to, to help the, that our economy recover so that we can recover those jobs and put those people back to work again. Michael Corrigan is the CEO of Visit Jacksonville. He says hotel occupancy in the River City is in the 54 percent range, which he adds is better than most cities in the state and across the country. He attributes that to two major factors, a safe reopening and the city's tourism market. The governor and the mayor um, reopened our economy in a safe, um, s slow environment. So we were able to, um, visitors were able to look and say, okay, this is a safe place to come. So I think that was part of it. Jacksonville is what Corrigan calls a split tourism market, bringing in visitors for both leisure and business. He says leisure travel is coming back faster. The business travel, with the exception of groups and stuff of that nature, is not coming back yet. But business travel to do, um, whether it's um, first responders taking care of those with the pandemic or, or upgrading facilities while they're empty, those types of workers have come back and are staying at our hotels. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.